The first 10 billion naira donation is to directly support victims of the flood disaster, while the additional 10 billion naira is for rebuilding public infrastructure destroyed by the flood. The governor during the presentation appreciated the federal government and other well-spirited individuals for donating to the cause of the flood victims, assuring judicious utilization of the funds donated. On the quantum of money that should be donated to the basket fund, I want 50% to go directly to the victims and 50% for the procurement of food items. Professor Zilim also inaugurated a 26-man committee to ascertain the causes of the collapse of Alo Dam, leading to massive destruction to lives and property, with Abba Graba as the chairman and the acting managing director of the Chad Basin Development Authority as the secretary. Terms of reference of the committee include examining the causes of the collapse and recommend measures to aid the spillage of the dam, which has yearly continued to plot farmlands, among others. The governor, who noted the constitution of a similar committee at the national level, also charged the state committee on Allo Dam to submit its report in four weeks. If nothing is being done in order to stop the water spillage from the dam, very soon in the next two to three months, the dam will be completely empty. And then we shall experience serious water scarcity in my degree Metropolitan Council. Chairman of the Committee on Allo Dam, Abba Graba, assured the governor of their commitment to work in line with the terms of reference and submit its report within the stipulated period.